a great colorway with great materials equals a great shoe. And I do love the hidden detail of that double swoosh. <laughs> Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scope. Today we have the Air Force One Retro, AKA the Friday. And this pair is in black, white, black. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like, leave your thoughts, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah uh, yeah, purchase links for these in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot. So yeah, let's start from the soles up. So we have a black outsole. We have a black on black midsole, midsole stitch, Nike Air and Strip. And then we come to this upper. So this upper is composed of mainly a black leather and we've got some white as well. And if we start from around the toe, you'll see that we've got black leather around the toe and on the toe box. The leather quality of this one is pretty good, pretty decent. Um, nice quality, nice little bit of grain to it. Going up the shoe, you'll see that we have black leather for the eye stay. And at the base of the eye stay, we have a black mini swoosh. Another look at that eye stay, you'll see that the cut of it is quite different. It's that old school kind of cut, which we've seen on the color of the months and some of the other retros, very, very nice. Above this, we have some black laces to the thickness that I like. These black laces conceal a black leather tongue and at the top of this tongue, you'll see that we have a white tongue tab with black for the Nike Air. If we take a look at the mid portion of the shoe, you'll see that the mid panel is also in black leather and then we come to the swoosh. But look closely, this is a double swoosh. So you'll see that we have a white swoosh right here and this is backed by a black swoosh. Very, very interesting. You might have missed it the first time having a look at these, but yes, this is a double swoosh. The foxing is the same as the rest of the upper, that black leather. And then we come to the heel of the shoe where the white leather re-emerges again with black for the Nike Air. Taking a look at the inside of the shoe, you'll see that the sock liner is quite soft, very, very nice in black, as well as the insole with white detailing for the Nike Air. Let me know what you think of this one. For me, pretty good. This one is pretty good. A great colorway with great materials equals a great shoe. A very, very nice one, the black and white. The white just pops so nicely. And I do love the hidden detail of that double swoosh. Not the first time that we've seen this shoe. The most recently we saw it was in 2019, I believe it is. I did do a review of them back then, but it's nice to see them again in all its glory. Taking a look at the laces, obviously black laces in this one. Perfect in my opinion. You could swap them out to a white lace, that would work as well. I can't think of any other laces um, you could swap. Maybe a red lace, I don't know. Depends on your outfit. Let me know what laces you'd swap out to these. Remember, the black laces are the only ones that come with this one. So if you wanna do a lace swap, you can do from your lace box. This pair fits like normal Air Force Ones. Compared to other shoes, go down half a size. Let's see how these look on feet. <laughs> Solid pair in my opinion, that's why I give these an eight out of 10. Very good, nice, easy to wear. You can wear these with almost anything. A solid, solid pair. 
definitely pick these up if you want them. Remember, purchase links in the description. Check out my previous review of these. Um, let me know if there's been any improvement. <laughs> it's right up there. I've been Scopes, signing out. Thank you everybody for subscribing, sharing your thoughts. It's always, always appreciated. All the comments and everything, always appreciated. Signing out. See ya.